hello good morning wonderful people so i hope you guys are doing great there's some good news for you um so according to the immigration nationality act any person who is likely to become a public charge is inadmissible to the united states this means that if you are applying for a visa or you're applying for an adjustment of status application to get a green card and you are deemed or you are seen to um, become a public charge in the future then you will be denied the visa or you will be denied the green card okay now when president well ex-president trump came into power he actually um implemented or instituted a final rule that interpreted this this aspect of the statute very broadly okay um, he interpreted the statute to include both public cash benefits and non-public cash benefits so let me backtrack a little bit if you're applying for a green card or a visa you have to show the u.s government that you have enough money to you know sustain yourself if you're applying for a green card the standard is that the person who's sponsoring you should be earning 125 percent above the federal poverty guideline and so you're not likely to become dependent on the government you know for your subsistence and so um this rule pretty much is talking about public cash benefits but president ex-president trump in you know um broadened the definition to include even um, non-public cash benefits like medicaid food stamps and all that so if you are receiving any of those things then you will be denied a green card because you were inadmissible under the public charge rule because you know you were going to be here in the u.s on you know giving give it meant that you were going to be here on the public dime right you meaning that the taxpayers would pay money and then you would be here you know taking all sorts of benefits and not really contributing to the u.s economy by just taking away from them okay now um president so when ex-president well current president trump came into power they actually did away with um um president ex-president trump's definition of the public charge rule and so if you remember in march 2021 the i944 which was the wealth test um was rescinded okay and so now we're no, we're no longer required to file the form i944 so the great news is that president joe biden has actually um you know through his administration they've codified the definition of what who a pub you know what public charge means and the fact that it would only include um this means that um you know if you are likely to be a public charge it means that you need long-term government funded institutionalization or public cash you're part of a public cash benefits program these are uh, for example supplemental security income or you're receiving temporary assistance for needy families that's the ta and f okay so these ones will actually make you inadmissible to receive a green card if you are here in the United States. So it's good news. Um, this rule goes into effect, I believe, in December. 20, this um, regulation, it's a now a regulation, goes into effect um, December 23rd, I believe, 2022. It's being codified. So that's great news. Um, so bear in mind, the public charge rule is a very important rule. If you're applying for a green card, make sure that you have a sponsor who can demonstrate that they're going to be responsible for you and you're not going to become a burden you're not going to become a burden on the u.s tax payer okay and again one thing i'd like to just bring to your attention is that there's some people or there's some categories of persons who are exempt from the public charge so for example asylees refugees um abuse victims um you know under the VAWA program if you've been abused you know during the pendency of your marriage to a u.s citizen or green card holder and you're filing a vow application you're exempt from this um public charge rule and also people who are filing for t visas and you non-immigrant visas t visas are for you know victims of labor labor trafficking and u visas are for victims of qualifying crimes okay um guys i hope this is helpful to you all the best and follow me for more